Good afternoon, Reverend Carol here, St. Luke's. We're going to do daily devotions at noon, page 138, Book of Common Prayer, and continue with the, Paul's first letter to the Corinthians, chapter 9, verses 13 through 18. Give praise, you servants of the Lord. Praise the name of the Lord. Let the name of the Lord be blessed from this time forth forevermore. From the rising of the sun to its going down, let the name of the Lord be praised. The Lord is high above all nations and his glory above the heavens. Do you not know those who are employed in the temple service get their food from the temple? And those who serve at the altar share in what is sacrificed on the altar? In the same way, the Lord commanded that those who proclaim the gospel should get their living by the gospel. But I have made no use of any of these rights, nor am I writing this so that they may be applied in my case. Indeed, I would rather die than that no one will deprive me of my ground for boasting. If I proclaim the gospel, this gives me no ground for boasting, for an obligation is laid on me, and woe betide me if I do not proclaim the gospel. For if I do this of my own will, I have a reward. But if not of my own will, I am entrusted with a commission. What then is my reward? Just this, that it is my proclamation that I may make the gospel free of charge, so as not to make full use of my rights in the gospel. Prayers this day are the Collect on the Day of the Ascension. Grant, we pray, Almighty God, that as we believe your only begotten Son, our Lord Jesus Christ, to have ascended into heaven, so we make also in heart and mind there ascend, that with him continually dwell, who lives and reigns with you and the Holy Spirit, one God, forever and ever. Amen. We give you thanks, Father Almighty, for the gift of your Son, for his taking on flesh to be as us, for his life and his teachings, for his passion and death and resurrection, and now for his ascension of taking within uh, the Trinity, within your heart, returning to you as humanly and divinely made. Gracious God, he, our advocate, soon to send another one, is there giving to you our prayers, our petitions, our intercessions, and always to remind you of your love for us and our love for you. In Jesus' name, amen. We say our Lord's Prayer on, from page 97, the contemporary version. Our Father in heaven, hallowed be your name. Your kingdom come, your will be done on earth as in heaven. Give us today our daily bread. Forgive us our sins as we forgive those who sin against us. Save us from the time of trial and deliver us from evil. For the kingdom, the power, and the glory are yours now and forever. Amen. Blessed Savior, at this hour you hung upon the cross, stretching out your loving arms. Grant that all the peoples of the earth may look to you and be saved. For your mercy's sake. Amen. May you continue to have a blessed day.